Hi friends, here in this video, I will be explaining what is meant by a velocity ratio. Now in case of simple machines, the effort which we are applying in order to lift a load is very less compared to the amount of load which we are lifting. But at the same time, the distance by which the effort is moving will be greater than the distance by which the load is moved. So we can say that the distance which is covered by the effort is greater compared to the distance traveled by the load. This can be taken or understood with an example like if we have a screw jack in that case at the end of the handle of the screw jack when we are applying the effort then we need to rotate this handle by a long distance or complete revolutions number of times in order to lift the load. So comparatively the distance traveled by the effort or the effort which we are applying at the end of the handle is considerably greater than the amount of load to be lifted and this ratio of the distance traveled by effort to the distance traveled by load is called as the velocity ratio. I will write the definition here. Now velocity ratio it is denoted by v dot r and mathematically the formula is given by velocity ratio is equal to Distance travelled by effort to the distance travelled by load The distance travelled by effort is denoted by y whereas the distance travelled by load is denoted by x so y upon x is the formula of velocity ratio then since both are distances it means they would get cancelled out the unit gets cancelled out and velocity ratio doesn't have a unit and as explained below the distance traveled by effort would be greater so since y is greater than x and that is the case always in case of a simple machine so it means the answer of velocity ratio would always be greater than 1. So in short that was an explanation regarding the velocity ratio. At the end if you will find my videos helpful you all can like share comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.